Hello friends, I am Dr. Surbhi Kapoor, Consultant Geneticist, Hague Fertility. Today we will discuss about on the uh, topic genetic testing on embryos. Genetic testing on embryos is an add-on procedure that is done on the embryos prepared via IVF. In this uh, procedure, embryo, the out, a few cells are taken out from the outer layer of an embryo that is trophectoderm and it is sent to the lab for the genetic testing. Genetic testing, how genetic testing is important and what does it rule out? Let's discuss it. Genetic testing on embryos help us to check the count of chromosomes in an embryo prior to placing them in a uterus. A normal human cell has 46 chromosomes, that is 23 pairs. So, sometimes due to unequal division of chromosomes in parents, it can lead to an abnormal number of chromosomes in an embryo that can be either lead to implantation failures or miscarriages. Pre-implantation genetic testing of chromosomes that is PGTA help us to understand the count of chromosomes in an embryo and it help us to uh, understand the genetic status of an embryo whether it is euploid that is having the correct count of chromosome or it is enuploid that is having an abnormal count of chromosome prior to the transfer and it helps clinicians and parents to select a euploid embryo for the transfer which improves which improves the IVF success rate which minimizes the miscarriage rate. Morphologically graded embryos does not mean that they are genetically good. So in conventional IVF, we transfer embryos on the basis of morphological grading grade 1, grade 2, grade 3. But how is the genetic insight? We don't know. So genetic testing of embryos help us to understand that the embryo transferred is chromosomally count wise normal and it helps in the better clinical pregnancy rate. Second important point is that genetic testing on embryos help parents to minimize the risk of transfer of genetic disease from parents to offspring. If there is any increased risk of or if the couple is at any increased risk of or they are being carrier for any genetic disease. So genetic testing on embryos that is pre-implantation genetic testing for monogenic disorders PGTM help parents to deselect the embryo that is uh, genetically or that um, that embryo is affected with that particular uh, genetic disease will not will deselect that embryo and will not transfer the embryo that is affected genetic testing on embryos is pretty helpful in case of advanced maternal age women where they know that they are at increased risk of having chromosomal aneuploidy in the embryo there is an increased risk of uh, having uh, miscarriages due to chromosomal aneuploidy so genetic testing is pretty uh, helpful for those females to uh, have a healthy pregnancy to have a better uh, pregnancy rate minimum miscarriages rate by selecting pre-genetic testing of embryos along with the IVF pre-implantation genetic testing of uh, embryos is pretty helpful in case of females who came up with a recurrent pregnancy loss or they have a history of any abnormal, abnormal child in the family family, any Down syndrome or anything. Pre-genetic testing of uh, embryos is pretty helpful in case of couples who have an abnormal karyotype or they are reported to have a, any translocation in their chromosomes where they know that they are uh, at the increased risk of transferring an embryo or their embryos are at an increased risk of having chromosomal aneuploidy. So genetic testing on embryos is basically a boon in IVF where clinicians, parents get a chance to select a healthy embryo where they, we have a chance to select an embryo that is not a carrier or not is affected with the disease that the parents are carrier and it is and it helps in having them a minimum rate of miscarriages, improved IVF success rate and a healthy pregnancy. How I hope that uh, the session was helpful and it is pretty clear why genetic testing of embryos should be opted in IVF and who are the parents, who are the couples who are recommended to go for this testing. Thank you everyone.